Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your all-inclusive experts, and today I'm at the beautiful Dreams Los Cabos Golf and Spa Resort. It's a beautiful beachfront resort, as you can see here. It's on, located on the corridor between San Jose del Cabo and Cabo San Lucas. It's a family-friendly resort. We do a lot of weddings here, a lot of groups, and of course, you know, families coming down. It's got a huge pool area, you've got a great adults-only section as well, and one of my favorite features is this incredible preferred club oceanfront area and all of the amenities that come with that. We love AM Resorts, we love Dreams, and we know that you're gonna love this resort, so why don't you follow along as I tour the resort. So the heart and soul of every beach resort is of course the main pool. This is a massive and beautiful main pool. It's got an incredible infinity edge, looks like it falls off over into the ocean. All around the pool you've got the seating, really nice plush loungers, and of course drink and food service around the pool as well. Over to my right now, you can see the swim up bar. Taylor's really excited that they have an espresso maker in the swim up bar, you don't see that very often. But of course, fantastic bartenders, there's seats all the way around, wrapping around the corner there. There's also some seating in the pool on the far side as well. And one cool feature about this particular pool is that there's a bench that goes all the way around the outside of the pool. So it's perfect, parents wanna sit in there, keep an eye on the kids, that's a perfect spot for that. Now continuing along, I love that they have this fountain in the middle of the pool. Kids always love that as well. You've got the hot tub tucked away over to the side. And on the far end, there's even a tiny water slide. It's not massive, but for the smaller kids, they're really going to enjoy it. Now all around the pool, in addition to that, this is more of an action and activity pool. In addition to you know, the bar and the restaurant and all of that, they also have activities over here. They've got a foosball table set up right now. They have ping pong, cornhole, lots of games going on throughout the, the day. They also do games in the pool as well. I see some football, volleyball over there. And uh, right now they've got the speakers covered up. But what I like is when they put effort and money into quality. They have these QSC speakers. It's a company we're very familiar with from Southern California. I think the best in the business. And they've really done a good job with that. Now this resort was renovated just about six years ago and it was a top to bottom renovation. They did a phenomenal job and they've continued with the up to keep and you can really tell. So this is the main hot tub right here. But another great feature of this is all around it, you have this shallow beach entrance. So you can step right in here, walk in just a little bit, and that's perfect for every member of the family once again. I love that, you can kind of lay in here and also for activities as well. But in just a few minutes, you better believe, I'm gonna be right over there at the Sugar Reef Bar, and I'll see you there. So also connected to the main pool is the Seaside Grill and Sugar Reef Bar. So right here you can see the seating for it. You've got two, four, eight tops. Lots of different diverse ones. They also have the kids' uh, chairs as well. I love that they have those. It was perfect for my daughter when we were traveling, when she was little, that they had all of those pieces that we didn't have to bring with us. Now, this has a really large menu. I was surprised on, on how much, but basically it's the grill items that you expect, the burgers, the tacos. They had a fantastic buffalo chicken sandwich. And as you wrap all the way around the corner there, that's the, the bar that you saw from the earlier part of the video. So that is the Sugar Reef Bar, it's the swim up bar, and it also used to service all around the pool. So both this restaurant and the bar are used for food and drink service around the main pool. So right here you can see where the slide comes from the top pool down to the lower pool. This is a pretty deep pool right here, but one of the best features of it is you've got these waterfalls. So as you head down, you kind of swim through the waterfalls, it's really fun. And just in front of that, there's an extra shallow pool that's perfect for the smaller kids. In fact, yesterday we got to see a dad was in there teaching his kiddo how to swim. Mom was sitting by with a cocktail, which is in my life and my wife, that's the way it should be. So set just below the main pools and on the beach, you have this huge activities area here, and it's used for just about everything. They set up basketball right here, but what this really is is the entertainment zone. So last night they had a fire show. It was really cool. They also had a big screen set up to have kids' movies, but if there is an activity that you can have at a resort, they do it right here. They've even had an amazing Super Bowl party right here as well. As we continue along, they've got this stage set up, once again for entertainment. I love the dream sign that they have there, but this is used for yoga in the mornings. It's used for entertainment in the evenings. Once again, anything you can imagine. I've also seen it used for weddings. Now this property is very, very popular for weddings for a lot of reasons. One, most of the time at weddings, there are going to be kids and having a multi-generational resort like this where it's family friendly, it's perfect for that. And so some brides decide to get married right here, others down on the beach itself if you want your toes in the sand. There's quite a few areas on the property that are perfect for it, but if you want a wedding, let us know. It's one of our specialties. All right, so down here you can see a little more of the activities that they have. Over to my right, they've got beach volleyball set up. That's always a lot of fun, competitive amongst guests. They also set up the basketball hoop over here to the left, which, well, 
If you see it, it's a little bit bent. Sorry about that, those slam dunks last night. Well, just going after it, you know? But as we continue along, you've got cornhole right there. They can set that up right here. You also have a really cool soccer billiards game in addition. And one fun thing I just wanted to point out is right here, they've got uh, kind of different guess and where they live and how far it is from it. Because right here, you're in paradise. And I know right now in Calgary and Edmonton, it's not like this. It's a little bit snowy out there. So let's continue along. You can see you have all of these palapas with the chairs. They'll put out more chairs throughout the day as well. But the reason you sit here is you've got the fantastic bar just behind me, the Barefoot Grill as well. So you can have food and drink service on the beach in Mexico. And it's absolutely beautiful. So another one of the Dreams classics is the Barefoot Grill. What perfect place to get a nice burger, some tacos, whatever it is you want by the beach. But right here, you've got the table set up around here. And then of course they service the beach as well. But one interesting feature right here is this property is set perfectly for whale watching season. There's, there have been some already. We're here in December right now. Of course, January and February is where they really ramp up and it's not rare at all to see whales off the coast jumping and breaching. And if you see one, they encourage you to come down and ring the bell. Hopefully nobody, well, nobody's up yet. Anyway, ring the bell and then everybody around knows that the whales are out. You can check it out. And there is nothing more fun and exciting for kids than to see a whale breaching just in front of the property. So as soon as I said that, we looked out and actually saw the spouts coming up. So there are a bunch of whales. So I'm gonna go ahead and ring it. That way anybody who's around and up can check it out. And I'm gonna stay here for just a few more minutes because that is so cool. That is awesome. So as we continue along, now we are in the preferred club area. So those of you who've chosen to upgrade to a preferred club room or suite, this is one of the main reasons to do so. As you can see, it's a nice extra area, lots of chairs. You've got the, the sun protection, of course, with the palapas, my favorite place the bar and had some amazing bartenders here yesterday. They were absolutely fantastic. They're always so engaging and uh, a lot of fun. But once again, higher level of service, you've got a little bit higher level of alcohol that's available as well, just like in the preferred club. And then as we continue along, I just wanted to point out one other great feature for those of you who have that dream of getting a massage on the beach. This is the perfect spot for that. You can see it's set up right now for a couple's massage. You can also have solo as well, but it's just close enough to the water where you get that constant sound of the waves, very relaxing. And I can't think of a better place to get a massage myself. So set just on the corner of the resort, you have another very popular venue for a wedding. And you can see exactly why. Picture a bride and groom standing here underneath this beautiful cupola and you have the ocean right behind you. You have some waves here, so you get that nice ocean sound in the background and well, sunrise, sunset. Well, I don't think you wanna get married at sunrise, but sunset certainly is a beautiful time to get married in this spot. So all throughout the resort, between the pools and the beach, they have these great setups here for showers. So they got the rainforest shower head and then down below, let's push that button. You can rinse your feet right on off and get that sand off before you head up into the pool or back into the resort. So now we're headed into the Oceana restaurant. And those of you familiar with Dreams and Secrets Resorts, this is a mainstay. It's the seafood restaurant, and it's set here once again in a beautiful oceanfront setting. What better place to have seafood that was just pulled out of the ocean than right here looking at it. So as we head into the restaurant, you can see it's got a nautical theme. And as we head further in, you can see they have two tops, four tops. They've even got bigger tables for 10, and they can put them together for larger groups. Being a family resort, of course, that's something that is very important. Now, as we continue through the space, you can see that some of it is covered. They've got fans. I really like that. I always love having the air moving. It's wonderful. And then as you continue through, you can see that they also have this open air seating area here as well. But what's interesting about this particular restaurant is that it shares a bar and it also shares the grill with the bar manatees, which is attached to the adults only pool. And if you're going to have a great family resort, one of the absolute musts, of course, is an adults only pool and here it is. Before we head over there, I just wanted to point out some little things that they've been doing, some touches. And I love this, especially for the kids. You can see that they have a small garden here. They've got lemongrass and pineapple, mint, chilies, but really what it does is it just shows kids specifically how these things are grown and they do use it in the kitchen. Now, one of the things that I really like about this particular pool, being the adults only pool, is that it's a sunrise pool, meaning the sun's gonna come up right in front of it. It's the perfect place to grab a cup of coffee, have a nice relaxing morning here. 
But as the day progresses, you're gonna find that this is an adults only pool. It's a huge one, it's absolutely beautiful. I love that you can swim long distances in there. I've even seen some people swimming laps in there. But what I love about this is of course, the swim up bar. You can't have an adults only pool without a swim up bar. But to cap that part off, you also have these great seats that are in the pool and tables. So you can have a cocktail right there as well. But once again, after my first visit here, they saw me floating by. They named the bar after me, the Bar Manatees. And you'll probably see me floating quite a bit, probably with a pina colada in hand. So now you can see the wide expanse of the pool. It's absolutely huge. You've got these great loungers set up all the way around the sides. And I also love that they have kind of a bench seat that follows the entire pool all the way around so you can sit in the water. In addition, they've got some shallow spaces here where you can stretch out. But I wanted to point out right over here, this is where you're gonna get all your towels. It's where the pool concierges are. Of course, you do have drink service throughout the entire area as well. But if you forget sunscreen or something, they're gonna be happy to take care of that for you. Now, one other fantastic feature is right behind me here is the bathrooms. I love having the restrooms very, very close by to the pool. You can run and use it if you need to. And the other reason that those are there is this is another spot that can be used to host parties, whether it's a wedding, you just had a beautiful wedding at the gazebo right in the ocean. They set that up around the pool here, but also you can have different kinds of corporate events as well. One other feature that I wanted to point out is the pet area just behind. This resort is small dog friendly. Dogs can't go everywhere in the resort, but this is a nice little spot for them. So now we're just inside the World Cafe. This is the classic all-inclusive buffet that you would expect at all resorts. So you can see that they have the table set up. They've got six, eight, fours. They can push them together, of course, as well. Uh, but as we continue on, this is the entrance to the buffet line. It's a really large one. It actually goes all the way across the distance that we just covered. And then as you wrap around the corner, behind here, there's another buffet line as well. But as you get over here, you can see how it really opens up. It's a, it's a big space. Once again, you have the child seats right here. Perfect especially when you wanna lock those kiddos in and get them to eat. I know my little one, she always wanted to move around. Uh, and as we continue through here, you can see they have the, the bread corner right there. Just behind, they had fresh juices, all kinds of breakfast, omelets made to order, those kinds of things. But it's also a lunch and dinner buffet as well. And the final thing I wanted to point out was the baby corner. Once again, they have that as well, where you can have, you know, heat up bottles, whatever it is that you need, but it is a family friendly resort and they've got every member of the family covered here as well. So now we're just inside Portofino, which is the classic Italian option. Every all-inclusive has an Italian option. And you're gonna find on the menu the things that you would expect, the pasta carbonara, insalata caprese, maybe you wanna top it off with some tiramisu, but they have all of those options. And they also have a great pizza oven as well, so you can order from a range of pizzas. But what you see here is you've got some great classic Italian decor. You've got tables for two, four, six, eight. They even have a high top table up in the corner there if you have a larger party. Now, something that's interesting about this particular resort is, and this particular restaurant is if you wanna elevate the experience, you can do a wine meal. So basically it's an upgraded concept where you dine in here. It's a private place. Maybe you wanna celebrate a birthday. You could buy some upgraded alcohol or, or you know, wines, bottle service, and this would come with it. So, but when you look in here, another beautiful look, you've got all the wine bottles all around, and then I smell something incredible. And of course it's the, giant wheel of Parmesan. So now we're back at the Seaside Grill, and yes, we already mentioned it before, but before I was talking about it as a casual eatery, and of course, you've got that happening right now, but later on in the evening, it turns into a steakhouse to add another one of those all-inclusive options for you to choose from. So now we're inside Bordeaux, which is the French restaurant. I do like that they have both indoor and outdoor seating here. It's a really nice compliment. But one of the best parts about this particular restaurant is that it's 18 and older. So once again, throughout the resort with the adults only pool, the other areas, you can have a great adult experience without kids. But of course, you can also have the other experience as well. As you look around, you've got these great booths over in the corner. And got booths here that can combine two, four, six, eight tops. They also have a larger table over in the corner as well. But you see the theme and the decor throughout is French. You've got a bunch of Eiffel Towers. You've got some great candles. And of course, well, there's my champagne glass. I don't know why they keep filling it with corks, but it'll be empty by tonight when I get back here. One of the things that I like at an all-inclusive is, of course, that you have almost everything included. They have a good wine list that's complimentary, but many of our customers, especially in this restaurant, decide to upgrade to one of the fancy champagnes or something else along those lines. They have a really large variety, and then you just pay the upgrade fee and you can take advantage of it as well. 
So for those of you traveling with kiddos, you have the Explorer Club right here. This is for three to 12 year olds. They're gonna have activities throughout the entire day. And of course, we'll take you in and show you what it's all about. But what it's really about is fun. And what I know is that if every member of the family is happy, the entire experience is gonna be better, not just for the parents, not just for those you're traveling with, but for everybody at the resort. And then of course, well, it's Christmas time and I think it's time to pull the lever. I didn't get any presents. Where are my presents? So this is the Explorers Club check-in area. We highly recommend that all parents or anybody who's gonna be picking up or dropping off the kids throughout the stay, that they come in and check the kiddo in together the first time. That way they know exactly who is allowed to do that. You've got this activity schedule. Of course, it's available throughout the resort as well. It's on the television. But this is where you do your check-in and check-out. They've got the security here. And then let's head on into the club. So now we're just inside the club. The first space I wanted to point out is the restroom area. I love that they've designed it, of course, with kids in mind. You've got the smaller sinks right here, the smaller toilets as well. Especially important, I know when my daughter was potty training, that made all the difference in the world. Now, as we continue on in, you can see the club itself. There's so much fun happening throughout the entire stay here with the kids. They love it. In fact, I used to be a camp counselor. Whoops, apparently I can't juggle anymore. And that's where I learned how to juggle. But anyway, I love being here because I know how much fun my daughter, my niece and nephew are gonna have. If you look around the entire space, I mean, just look at it. You've got the cubbies here. You've got the small foosball table. You've got the huge TV screen there where they're gonna put the movies throughout their, their time here. They even have a huge Hot Wheels track you wanna play some music, you got a drum set, you got the guitar. And then as you continue on over here, this is the arts and crafts area. So one of the favorite activities I know for my daughter, she loves to color, she loves to have all kinds of fun with her friends and then bring it back to us throughout this day. In fact, usually anytime we say at here or another dreams, she usually ends up having an entire suitcase full of things that she's created throughout her stay here. You can see right now it's set up for the holidays. You've got the Christmas trees everywhere. They've got these great blow ups but just the small attention to details make all the difference, but it's really the people. It's the camp counselors, it's the people that work here. One other very favorite activity that I just wanted to point out over in the corner is, well, every kid loves their video games. So right here, you've got Xbox Connect, you've got PlayStation 4, you also have Nintendo Switch over there. They've got these great video game rockers, they also have the pads where they can set it all up here, but for a three to 12 year old, they're gonna have a lot of fun. Feliz Navidad, prospero año y felicidad. I wanna wish you a merry. Santa, why aren't you singing? Come on, you know the song. Eh, whatever. So now let's head outside. You can see an extension of the activities that they do inside. One of the things they do is they teach them how to make paper airplanes, really, really good ones. You've got a competition throwing through these. A lot of fun. I know we had one of these in our backyard for a long time when my daughter was even littler. They've got the, even they've got the nice umbrella for the, the table, love that, connect four. This is just a fun play area for the kids. But what this space is really all about is unique to this property is of course the splash pad. So you've got the bucket drop, you've got the waterfall right there. But once again, just amplifies that experience. So there's something for every single kid because we all know that kids are different just like adults. Each one of them is gonna like something different. So with the vast variety of things to do, they're always gonna find some fun. Oh, goodness. Oh wait, no, never mind. sorry. Rock climbing wall. All kinds of fun things to do for kids of every age or those of us who think that we're kids. But right here, you've got this great rock climbing wall and a complimentary assortment of fun outdoor activities. So continuing along, you've got the batting cage right there. Always perfect. In fact, I remember when I was playing baseball, my dad would always look for a, a batting cage when I was 12, 13 years old, getting me ready for high school. Went with the basketball scholarship instead, but well, you can see why. Here you have the bungee trampoline, absolutely a blast. They basically clip the kids in, do a lot of jumping. And then continuing on, I know my daughter for one would absolutely love this and my niece and nephew. You've got this great slide and you know climbing area for the smaller kids. And there's even a small rock climbing wall over here as well and a couple of swings. Now, if you continue along, there's one more outdoor activity in this area that I wanted to point out. The tennis court, this is a, a fun activity. Once again, this is not just for kids, this is for adults as well. So if you just wanna have a fun game, or maybe once again, you're practicing for a high school tournament or something, perfect place for that. So now we're in the Dream Spa by Pavonia. And one of the things that's unique about this particular spa is you have this incredible rainfall water feature as you head in. So as soon as you walk into the spa, 
you immediately start that calmness. You've got your check-in right here. They have a full assortment of retail back there, so if you like the products that they're utilizing, of course, you can purchase them. And then as we head in, you have the men's locker room to the left, women's to the right. But before we head in there, I wanna show you a couple of the other features. This resort is fantastic for weddings. It's also perfect for quinceaneras, all kinds of different gatherings. And so having a full service salon is really important. If you follow me in, you can see right here, you've got a couple hair stations right there. You also have the uh, manicure stations and petty stations. What I love is these are the big ones. They even have the tub big enough for my gigantic size 15 feet. I think I'm gonna be having a petty later. Right next door, you're gonna find the full service hair salon. So you've got the sink right there for washing hair. You have two more stations right here for a total of four. Once again, if you wanna get ready to go out in the evening or if you're preparing for that special event, this is perfect. So as soon as you head into the spa, you get that aromatherapy scent. I absolutely love that. It starts calming you right away. And the first thing they're gonna do is assign you a locker. So in the locker, you're gonna have your slippers, you'll have your robes, and that's where you can change right here before you head on down to start your treatment. So now we're in one of two of the hydrotherapy areas. So they have this also on the other side for the ladies. Right here is the, for gentlemen. To my right, you're gonna have your sauna. So exactly what it is, it's a dry sauna. And then as you continue along, you're gonna have an aromatherapy steam room as well. They also have this great relaxation area. It's perfect to sit, get ready for your treatment. And uh, well, I absolutely love these things, but I'll tell you what, I would certainly rather be sitting here raking the sand, getting in the Zen mindset, then shoveling snow. As you continue your water journey, you can cap it off right here with the hydrotherapy pool. So this is a large jacuzzi hot tub. And in addition to that, you have these great water features as well. So if you wanna loosen up your back, take those knots out, this is a perfect place to do it, to relax either before or after your treatment. So now we're inside one of the treatment rooms. It's very classic. It looks like something that you're very familiar with. But one very unique feature about this particular one is that with the men's and women's locker rooms separated, they also have the ability to put together two rooms to have a couple's treatment. So as I step through here, you can see you have the second one here. You have this beautiful jacuzzi hot tub set up for nice relaxation before or after your treatment. Now, those of you who've had a treatment at Secrets or Dreams, you know what this is all about. My least favorite sound in the world, hmm, because it's over. Now throughout the resort, you're gonna find places where you have extra benefits if you've upgraded to that preferred club category. The spa is one of those. Every single person is going to get a 20 minute massage, complimentary as part of your preferred club amenities as of today. And in addition to that, you're gonna get 25% off your spa treatments. That alone could really add up to make the upgrade worth it. So now we're inside the gym, and I think it's a pretty good sized gym with pretty diverse amount of equipment for a, a resort of this size. So you've got your Smith machine here, you've got the dumbbells all around the side. One thing that I appreciate is they even have the high weight ones. Not that I'm gonna use them, but I know that there are very strong people out there that use them for training. You've got a whole variety of circuit machines all the way around. You've got the bench press. You also have the kettlebells and uh, of course the exercise balls over there. Continuation of all the machines here as well. I love that they have the, the two really nice rowing machines with the water resistance. And then as you continue along, you've got your aerobic section. So you've got your ellipticals and with a 20 foot high ceiling, I actually fit on these. You've got your treadmills as well. And then a stair stepper over there. But basically just about every bit of equipment that you could want, whether you're training, Maybe you're exercising or like me, walking by and seeing it for the first time. Okay, so you have a continuation of the gym outside. They've got the training section out here. You've got pull-up bars, I guess chin-ups as well. You've got the punching bag. <clears throat> That's 2020, by the way. Anyway, right here, you've got some more equipment out there. You've got your jump ropes and well, you know, let's get after it. I'm ready for a drink. Where's the, where's, where's the bartender? They don't have a bartender up here? Seriously? So this is a great place to see the entryway to dreams. So when you get here, it's very much set up like a Mexican hacienda style. You got these cobblestones coming in, not great on the cars, but it also lets you know that you have arrived. I love that. And growing up in Southern California, so much of our history is intertwined. This is Baja California, of course. And as soon as you get here and walk into the resort, I love that instant feel where you know that you're in Mexico right away. They do a great job with that. And of course the bell staff, they're gonna take your bags immediately. They're gonna take care of all those details. You check in right at the front desk or head right on over to the preferred club if you're in one of the upgraded categories. And once you're here, you know it and you're gonna have a great time. 
So as soon as you walk through the archway, you get to the courtyard, like every hacienda has. And you can see that this is absolutely beautifully decorated for Christmas. You've seen that throughout the tour as we've walked around the resort. One of my favorite things to do is to travel at the very end of November, early December, overnight. On the 30th of November, you go to bed, you wake up, and the entire resort looks like this. It's beautiful. And I think traveling around the holidays is a blast. And if you want to travel in early December, it's also a fantastic time to go too, because it's usually on the less expensive side. This part of the resort got a full renovation in the last couple years, and this is the check-in desk. It looks beautiful. You can see the decor all the way around. Head on over, and then once again, if you are in a preferred club room, you're going to say hi to our friends here. You're going to head right around the corner, have a seat, and be checked in in an express manner. The Rendezvous Bar is set right in the lobby. It's the perfect place to meet up with others. And, well, you can see you've got the full bar service, fantastic bartenders. All around the lobby, there's seating areas. So you've got some top, high top tables. You've got some couches. But once again, you can stay here and head right out above the pool. You have this beautiful courtyard as well, wherever it is, whether it's before dinner, after dinner, or, well, you just want a drink. It's a perfect spot for that. So now I'm at the Coco Cafe. This is always Taylor's favorite. He loves his coffee. And, well, he tells me that I don't quite barista it as well as he likes but they do here they do a great job you see you have a wide assortment of snacks you've got some grab and go foods i started my morning here i came and grabbed a coffee and then a little bit of a snack here but you can see that they have brewed coffee they've got all assortment of teas they've got all the syrups and such if you like those and then over here you've got your uh, espresso maker the grinder and well underneath don't tell anybody but there's ice cream under there too frosty i keep telling you the coffee shop is not the place to be you're gonna melt Seriously? I don't know, whatever, he never listens to me. So now we're inside the Desire Sports Bar and Nightclub. Another great feature to have at a family-friendly resort, another space where adults can escape. Was watching some football in here yesterday, appreciate that. Of course, this is a dance floor if you wanna, no, that's not gonna work today. Get down with all of your friends. You've got the stage here, the full bar setup, of course. You've got the DJ booth over here as well. But one of the things that we really appreciate is their attention to detail and the quality. Taylor, being a sound engineer, told me all kinds of details about these incredible QSC speakers. Apparently top of the line and some of the best out there. And just the idea that they would spend the money on that and invest in it so that they can have a better experience says everything about the resort. But as you look around the space, you've got plenty of seating areas. Once again, you've got the dance floor right here. And well, I might be dancing up there soon. And then you've got the high top tables, the TVs all the way around on both sides. And then you have these smaller tables tables, couches, just the perfect place to hang out. Maybe you want to watch a game or later in the evening, you want to get down and party a little bit, maybe have some dance with your spouse. I think this is the perfect place for that. So now I'm just inside the Preferred Club Lounge, and one of the great experiences here is when you're in the Preferred Club, the main check-in, you just walk right past that, you head right up here, you have this nice seat, and they're gonna check you in, take care of all the details for you. They're also gonna function as your concierge throughout the entire stay. So once again, you still get access to everything on the resort, you just have that extra level of quality. So as we continue on in, you're gonna find the bar and restaurant. So you can have small bites in the morning, you see that they've got it set, it up, set up right now, perfect for that if you just want a quick grab and go. Also have coffee set up, and this is what it's all about for me anyways, it's the bar. So you have an upgraded bar here. The bartender is absolutely fantastic and been keeping me very, very happy and, uh, well, very, very happy throughout my entire stay here. And one of those great extra perks. Now, as we continue on through the club, you can see it's a large space. This is a unique one where they have quite a bit of outdoor seating and indoor seating, but you see that the tables are set up right now for breakfast. You've got this large couch. I was watching some NFL football here yesterday, having a drink, love that. And they even have a kid's corner. So they've got a baby corner over there where they got the microwave if you need to heat something up, milk, things along those lines. They also have this great chalkboard and some kids stuff, and they'll bring the toys out as well. So maybe if you're checking in, waiting for a room, or uh, just wanna have a relaxing time in here, every member of the family is taken care of. Now this particular resort is a fantastic choice to host all kinds of meetings, whether you're doing a wedding reception, of course that can come inside, you may wanna keep that outside in the beautiful venues there, but if you're looking to do a business meeting, a corporate or incentive group, they have a wide variety of spaces or at least the adaptability of spaces. So you can just see a very simple setup here, but if you look up at the roof, you can see that they have several different partitions and it goes quite a bit further that way as well. So you can set this up into smaller breakout rooms or a larger meeting space. And one of the reasons people love this resort for it is that if you you can invite every member of the family with your corporate event so mom dad whoever it is that's in here that, that's doing their meetings can be here and every other member of the family can be out having fun and then they can join them right after so you can see why this might be a perfect choice for your incentive group 
First off, congratulations for making it all the way through the tour. We really appreciate that you spent that time with us. You can see what this resort is all about. It's a really fantastic option for a lot of families, groups, weddings, all kinds of different fits. And what I love is it's perfectly positioned between San Jose and between Cabo, so you can have the best of both of those worlds. When you're ready to book this incredible resort, reach out to Heart Travel. We are your all-inclusive experts. We know the spaces inside and out. We have a phenomenal relationship with AM Resorts, and we know that we can craft a vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, your family, your group, whatever it is, at an incredible value.